we will go ahead and install composer now composer is a package dependency manager for php and this is what we'll be using to install laravel and create a laravel project so uh, you can go to get composer dot org again i'll have the link in the descriptions and click on download as you can see it says uh, the installer which requires that you already have php installed is what uh, it says here but you only have php installed so that is not a problem now you can click on this to download composer so composer is now downloading and now let's install composer double click on your setup file and it will open and you can install for all users so any user on the computer will be able to access it or you can just install only for the current user and click install for all users click next and this is the php that will be used for our composer that we just installed that is fine click next again no need to enter anything here just click next click next again And our composer is installed so uh, as you can see it is installed and it is saying you may need to restart your computer so let's check if it is installed or not so first open your command windows type in command here and if you type composer let's see what happens so yeah it is saying composer version is 2.6 and we have all the stuff here 